Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy? Are you okay? <laughs> what are you doing? You're looking at baby's rabies. Huh? Do you have baby's rabies? It's gotta go on, buddy. It's gotta go on. We pee pee's everywhere. Hello. I just wanted to show people that out in the country, it's a truck that goes around and does the mail. A <laughs> right hand drive Honda CRV. Oh, yeah, we need, we need smoke detectors and a. And a uh... <laughs> Baby, every time you talk, he thinks it's great. And a carbon monoxide detector, right? <laughs> Just having a great time with my shoulder, right? The sucky baby. Oh, no. He just woke up. Hi! Hi, sucky man! Okay. <laughs> Look, James, Daddy's making a tough decision about your home safety, buddy. Oh, God. It's all on you, Alex. <laughs> if you don't make the right decision, your family dies. Yeah. Hi! What are you doing? What are you doing? You happy? I just wanted to put a quick thank you out there to the people who sold us the house. They're never going to see this video, but I'm very happy with them right now, and I want to thank them for all of the things that they didn't tell us about the house. Like for instance, the fact that the ceiling leaks, that they could have told us about. Why? Because if we had known that it leaked, we wouldn't have used the jacuzzi tub and we wouldn't have ruined the ceiling again. Also, that the washing machine leaks when you turn it on. That also would have been really good to know. And lastly, oh, lastly, the fridge does not work. All of a sudden it just, Conked out and now it's not working. So that's really good. Luckily the only thing that we have in there right now that's gonna go bad is soy milk. Am I right? Yeah, just well, that goes. Ooh. It's the light bulb that's right there, I guess. It just started working again. Thank God. Still, fuck them. I don't understand the point of hiding things in your house. Tell people so that they can fix them. You know what I mean? Like I, would, I was still paid the same amount of money. I wasn't. Yeah. They, my my purchase of the house was not hinging on the functionality of a jacuzzi. It was hinging on the fact that the whole house should be structurally sound in some way that it could, you know, support our living habits for six months without any maintenance. Really. Bought some foam today. There was some maintenance I knew was there, and they declared it was there, and the home inspector declared it was there, and I was fine with that. That's why I'm doing it. I like doing that kind of stuff. If I had known that the ceiling was fucked, I would have fixed it before we touched it. Yeah. I'm a fixable guy. I like doing it. It's not something I don't enjoy doing. But it's just like now, because they didn't tell us the jacuzzi didn't work, now we don't have to only fix the jacuzzi, we also have to fix the shitty ceiling, which is now <laughs> falling in. So that's good. Are you are you fake coughing? On the plus side, we're not gonna die in a house fire now. That's good. That, is, that makes three hundred bucks we spent on the house in the last week. Well, plus the forty-two thousand dollars we spent on it. <laughs> before that. I can bit. see a reflection of him sleeping. Poor little man. What happened, James? <laughs> we went out for a walk, and James fell asleep. <laughs> <laughs> 